Oh shit, that's some sort of pumpkin. Hey! I'd like to cash out now. Kian! Oh no, honey! Your car don't go there! That's the cub! Why you drive over it, honey? Something LGBT just happened to me just now. Like, I can't even make this shit up. You want to take a walk? Do you want to take a walk? You want to take a walk? You want to take a walk? Parent weekend this weekend. My parents aren't coming. Who's trying to be my mommy? Hi hey there. Is there a project you're working on? I know more than you. All right. How come every time I'm depressed, a dingling end up in my mouth? Well, girl, what kind of depression you got and how can I get some? Okay. If any of you noticed that racism has ended, then that was me. You're welcome. Yo, hey, can I have one more kiss before we go? Why don't you? Oh, okay. <laughs> cough right here. <laughs> I'm at Micro Center and I've just found the most incredible thing ever. It's only eight dollars. You know, for a long time I never really understood homophobia. However, after watching the movie Monster House, I, I can understand it. I can understand how you'd be scared of a home. Another day, another slave. Period. Somebody's been giving out vaccines in the alleyway. <sighs> what good people course of this campaign that you did Hello? Didn't. Please! <laughs> yes, I majored in Spanish. Why are people always like, why would you major in Spanish? What are you going to do with that? Why would you? So I could graduate with the actual skill, dumbass. Why does this light look like it's seen a girl with a fat ass walking by like, damn! Why would you just hang her up? Come on, fathers be doing anything. She cool and she sleep. What's your name? <laughs> oh my God. I spilled the fettuccine. Guys, can you name a woman for us? What? Name a woman. Can't. Walmart, and as you can see here, they have this convenient sign to indicate that this Walmart is Australian friendly. Oh no, my penis. I slammed it in the car door. This feels homophobic. Here I am, out in public, having a great time. I enjoy living in a society. Legs like those. I could probably do the splits real easy. What are we talking about? What are we talking about? I kind of think I want to end up with somebody athletic. I don't. I want them to. I want them to be adventurous, but they need to be out of breath with. <laughs> Ka, why are you driving my princess carriage? Cause I got stuff to do, Aubrey. Okay. Don't worry about yourself. Honestly, at this point, I would be fine with just being kidnapped and developing Stockholm syndrome and falling in love with my captor. Because this Tinder shit is not working. Do you, do you mind? I changed my Bumble settings to liberals within 50 miles that are looking for a relationship and I immediately, immediately got this. I hate it here. I'm a many time champion of the penis game. Penis. PENIS! <laughs> Pussy's gonna fall out. Pussy's fall out anyways. It's called prolapsing pussy. It's fine. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what in the tri-titties is this shit? I feel like I could pop this shit. Oh! <laughs> Bruh. You looking real sussy over there. Did you take the Fortnite car from me, bruh? Is there anything else I could get you? It's a go back. I don't think I'm comfortable eating here now, mom. Who needs a for you page when you have a from your girlfriend page? Who ate that cake? Who ate a piece of 
into that cake. Anybody had no damn cake? You better mind your damn business. You're fucking kidding me. No, you are kidding me. Fucking mosquitoes on me. <sighs> Charlie Puth, a grown man, will get on this app and be like, what if there was a song that went beep boop beep boop beep boop beep boop? Oh, oh, you want to get fucked up. You want to get, what is, is it a pill box or is it a mental health advent calendar? What kind of dirty trick is this, McDonald's? This is supposed to be a kid's four nugget. You gave me a box full of pickles. Abby. Oh. Your your father would be disappointed. My dad knows I'm a whore. <laughs> I will literally cut your bullsack. Yeah, my di my dick when I see a hot lady. <laughs> oh damn, bro, Rick is hanging on for dear life. Hold on, I'm gonna quickly hit him with something. I did not understand the amount of guys' feelings I would hurt by saying me, a 19-year-old girl, is not attracted to a 34-year-old man. They're all pregnant. They're all pregnant. They're all pregnant. pregnant. They're all pregnant. Oh my god. Oh my god. I know. So and that so many people in the bar were like asking about like, I don't do you know care what the if you're joking. Is up with that, that is not okay. I'm like, and she and said me? she was 12. <laughs> me and my niece did an ugly face contest. Face Wait for it. Here I am, Buckingham Palace, home of Queen. Freddie Mercury house is here. Freddie Mercury, very good homosexual man. He has mustaches like Joseph Stalin. He is my favorite. Okay, guys, what is something from today that you think would instantly kill a founding father? They them pussy. <laughs> Record at least one second. TikTok, fuck you. I don't need to. I said what I said. Y'all, the teacher sent home with my baby the wrong stuff. Whoever this kid was, they were supposed to spell pick. They spelled dick. <laughs> Why is Asia Seaguard1 uh, from HugeSex.com calling me spoinky goinky? Who sent you? Which one of you sent? Hey, someone looked at your profile today. Oh, okay, cool. Like, who was it? I don't know. But you told me someone looked at my profile, so, like, you know who it is. Yeah, but I don't want to say. But you could. <laughs> Fooba's in the chair. Fooba's in the air. Know that girl got Fooba underwear. She got a nice, a nice red size. Look at that Fooba sitting on them thighs. Fooba. Foo 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 go foo pa foo pa foo My daughter just made this for me and she said I can make it into earrings to wear. What do y'all think? It's good artwork, right? Oh. Okay, well apparently it's this. Okay, it's okay, yeah, go get, get it. it. Grab it and hand it to Aunt Fifty. Go get it! You got it? Yeah. Okay, I'm coming. Pull it out. <laughs> Keep pulling it. <laughs> Woo! -hoo -hoo. Okay. You were here, you, you got all the bitches right there. <coughs> Still do. Still got the bitches right there. You ate you the what? bitches right there. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so tell the story again. <laughs> All right, so Howie comes up to me earlier with this book, Silly Jokes for Kids. <laughs> he comes up and goes, <laughs> Hey, Papa, 
And I'm like, oh boy, what's up, kid? He goes, <laughs> I don't know how to read. <laughs> What's wrong? In this home, we are laugh. We make piss, we say I'm gay, we give loud hugs, we laugh together, we give bugs, we forgive Obama, we do drugs really well. Where is dog? There is meat. Ollie's. What's up? Uh, just give me a little peace of mind. Yeah, what do you need? I'll get back in an hour. You'll be back in like an hour? What the fuck? What? What are you doing, bro? What? You're standing up, you're like, I'm gonna go get a little peace of mind, I'll be back in a half hour. I have to, let's see. What do you have to do, huh? I have to be in class. Dude, you do not have class for another fucking <coughs> five hours, dog. At nine. And nine oh five. Well, it's four fucking a.m. And it's the third time you've been up in an hour talking about I have class at nine oh five a.m. Go the fuck back to sleep, or I will beat you back to sleep, pickle boy. Mm-hmm. I will knock you clean the fuck out. Towns, do you want to go outside? Yeah. No. You don't want to play? No. Uh, do you want a boat? No. You don't want a boat? No. Do you want a new car? No. What about a million dollars? No. Um, is there anything you want? No, nothing at all. Wow. What about a kiss? No. Okay, what about a hug? Do you want a hug? <gasps> What is it? Oh, it's a fry. <laughs> is it air fry? <laughs> <laughs> the hell is that? Is that a french fry? Uh-huh. That's so creepy. You have to take a bite. I just brushed my teeth. One time I got a phone call from a telemarketer asking about car insurance, so naturally when I picked up the phone I said, Hola, oh no habla inglés, lo siento. So they put me on with the Spanish speaking line. The second I got on the Spanish speaking line I said, I'm so sorry, I don't know how I got here, I think I clicked the wrong button, can you put me back? So they put me back to the English speaking line. The second the English speaking line asks me how my day is going, I say, No habla inglés, lo siento. And I went back and forth between the English and the Spanish speaking lines for damn near 20 minutes until someone finally yelled at me and hung up. I don't know if that's a testament to my commitment to the gag or to my true nature of being absolutely diabolical. <laughs>